Namaste friends, this is Aparna from Shubh Connections and we are going to be learning about pranayam. Pranayams are simply can be called breathing exercises, but they are way more than that. Because prana is a cosmic energy and it is the energy that moves everything, including our breath. And pranayam can add an immense value to your yoga practice. But it will be a good idea to learn about our respiratory system before we start doing pranayam practices. So I'm going to talk today about your respiratory system and everything that we use and how it works during pranayama. So our respiratory system starts from here. So yes, your nose and your mouth plays a very important role as well. And then there is larynx and there is trachea or windpipe as we call it. And then of course there are lungs, right and left lungs. And they both have alveoli and um, the connection of lungs to the heart. So there are some major muscles of breathing that contribute with each inhalation and each exhalation. What happens when we breathe in? So when we breathe in, the diaphragm, which divides the abdominal cavity and the thoracic cavity. So thoracic cavity is the upper part of the body and the abdominal cavity is the lower part and the diaphragm is just a dome shaped structure just in the middle. So every time when we inhale through the nose, the diaphragm goes down and it creates more space for lungs to expand. And why it is important to breathe in through the nose in your pranayama practice? Because nose is the organ that is designed for breathing. And that's what its job is. And there are three things that happen to the air in the nose is that there is a lining of the nasal passage that helps to moisten the air that we have inhaled. There are small, small hair in the nose. They are called cilia. So they collect all the debris and they don't let the material that shouldn't go inside your respiratory system. And then there are sinuses, there are sinus spaces. So those sinus spaces regulate the temperature. So with each inhalation, when you take that breath in and it goes and it relaxes the diaphragm, it goes down and with each exhalation diaphragm lifts and we exhale all the carbon dioxide and we inhale the oxygen. So this is how our respiratory system works and we will learn how this can be useful, this information can be helpful in our pranayam practice. So I will be bringing you lots of new pranayam practices soon and keep practicing yoga, keep practicing mindfulness and pranayam. Namaste.